Ah! Ah! Guys! Guys, I'm having flashbacks! Look, look! Look what it is! <laughs> it's Spore! Spore, guys! 2008 this game was released. It's 2017 now. That's nine years ago! That's crazy! Oh, look at it. Look how beautiful it is. Unfortunately, I don't have my old save games because if you didn't know because it, this was ages ago But I played this game as a series a long time ago. Let's check how long ago it was Spore it was two years ago. I think uh, no way That's today June the 24th three years ago. That's how That's crazy <laughs> <laughs> exactly three years ago, I started this little series called Spore. Hey everyone, down here. Okay, okay, side. okay. You can you can stop laughing now. Stop, stop. <laughs> Look at it. Oh man. So this was, I think, this very game was one of my first ever non-Minecraft series to do really, really well. You guys absolutely loved it. Now, what is Spore? So Spore is a game where you literally create loads of random creations. You raise them from literally a cell all the way up to the human beings, I guess. It's really awesome. You manage them all the way up. And today, I thought we'd hop straight back into Spore, not to play the game, but to create weird and wonderful things. So if we go up to here, I've never actually, I haven't actually tried this yet, but we've got um, loads of different ones. And also something I didn't have the last time I did Spore was I've also installed a new stuff pack, I guess that has loads of different new things that you can create spore creatures with. And I've also installed Galactic Dimensions or whatever it's called, which involves UFOs and stuff. So um, check this out. <laughs> but we want to create a creature, Space Outfitter. That looks gnarly. Civilization Outfitter, look at this guy. I don't actually know which one to choose. I guess I'm going to do this one. Let's see what happens. <laughs> I'm excited. So yeah, look, you literally can get whatever you want to create an epic beast. And I think you have to spend certain amounts of DNA points as well. So let's start creating. This is the body we're going to start with and we're going to make it a little bit longer all the way up there. There we go. I want to kind of start off with a giraffe style animal, but um, I thought we'd just hop into this, revisit the game and see what kind of crazy creations we can create. I have no idea what I'm doing. Can we just test drive this just by itself? Oh, <laughs> what's it doing? Oh, that's weird. It's just a worm. There it goes. Oh, oh, oh. <laughs> Wait, can I see any of the ones that I used to have? I don't think I can. My creations. No, that would have been so good to see. I'm trying to remember how to use this. Do we use this to make a head? We do. Oh, that's a beautiful head. Look at that. <laughs> its neck is so thin. Now it's even thinner. How many eyes do I want to give this thing? I'm going to give it um, just one big eye. <laughs> <laughs> That's huge. We definitely need to give it some feet. I feel like putting feet just on its body somehow, not with no legs. What about just one of these? Literally just one. No? Do you have to have legs? Oh, let's just get a really tiny leg and then we can do it from there. Oh, that's weird. Look at him. He's actually really cute. I kind of only want one leg though. Can you do that? I don't think you can. Whoa, okay. That got a little bit weird. <laughs> We're gonna make all his legs super small, but his feet absolutely massive. <laughs> <laughs> Look at that. Okay, he needs a mouth. He doesn't have a mouth, which is gonna have to go underneath. What is that? That's disgusting. That's gross. Oh, look at it. That's gross. You can make it really long as well. Oh, no. What have I done to this guy? Oh, look at him. Move it around. Go and open it again. Open its mouth. Oh. <laughs> okay. Weapons and details. Let's go into weapons. Wow. Okay. A circular saw. That's a bit crazy. What about details? We can give it wings. Oh, that's kind of cool. What about really tiny wings, though? Giant dragon wings. Those look super cool. There we go. Look at that, guys. I didn't think I'd create something I actually like. Oh, yes. <laughs> <laughs> Did you see his face there? We can make these super long. We make them fat and just give him one. There we go. Our first creature is complete. Look at him. Absolutely beautiful. Actually, he's not just yet. Oh, oh no. We need to paint him. We actually need to paint him different colors. So there's loads of different colors you can choose from. I think pink might be quite good. Oh, oh, it's loading. It's loading. Yes. Phenomenal. Oh, you can also change them like per bit as well, I think. Oh no, you can add bits on top. Yo, that looks cool. I kind of feel like he needs tiny little arms, like really, really small little arms. Exactly like that, <laughs> but with different hands. We need like claws. Perfect. 
Perfect, perfect, perfect. I need to make them smaller, though. There we go. <laughs> Let's try it with a turquoise on. Oh, yes. Yes, that's nice. Right, uh, we need to name it. Let's do random. Tifts. No, that's terrible. Ponge. That's a great name. Let's try him out. Let's see him in the wild. Look at this guy. He is phenomenal. He has got the movement of a prince because of his massive feet. Amazing. Alright, let's make him do some weird things. That's... What's that, Sad? Oh, he's kind of cute. What about... Uh, Raver Punch. Okay. Okay, what are you doing? Stop. 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 You're freaking me out. Can I save this guy? Ponge saved. Yes! So Ponge is cute, but I feel like... Hold on a second. Look, if I go on Steam, Spore, Spore Creepy and Cute Parts Pack and Galactic Adventures are all different. What happens if I play this? Did I just get ripped off by not being able to use any of my new parts that I bought? <laughs> I have no idea. I'm gonna try a civilization outfitter this time. Create or choose a civ creature. I'm gonna create my own. Yeah, look. Core spore, creepy and cute. I don't know if that was on there before. Yeah, look, there's different pages. Oh, I'm so dumb. Right, let's make a new one. Oh, they have so much more on this one. Okay, I'm gonna try and make as close to a human as I can. Uh, let's see. Let's see how well this goes. Start with the body. Let's also grab some legs. See, look at all these new ones. They're so cool. Not quite human-like. Look, they're literally bug legs. <laughs> there we go. That's not too bad. Can we get any human-like feet, though? We've kind of got loads of just paws and talons and stuff. Yeah, look. Literally feet. Oh, that's cool. Okay, I think these arms are going to be the best ones. Um, Does that look okay? That looks fine. Okay, this is actually going to be easier than I thought, I hope. He's a little fat, though. There we go. This guy is ripped. Just need some hands that will do the job. Look, you can get boxing gloves. <laughs> Got any hands? These look like the closest to hands. Boop. Oh, that's freaky. Just need to make a head now. Um, I guess like that? Um... <laughs> <laughs> He's got a massive head. That'll work though. That'll work. Right. What kind of eyes can we get? So these are the new eyes. Oh man, look at this. So freaky. It kind of I love having the Cyclops ones with a massive eye on their forehead. Oh, these look kind of human. And these ones too, the lady eyes. Oh, those look really human-like. Look at those. I wish I could zoom in more. So we also need a nose. We've got like snouts and stuff. That is definitely oh. <laughs> <laughs> oh my goodness. He enjoys it though. Or we could go for this, which is some kind of crazy next level crocodile mouth. Yes. What? Why are you saying no? <laughs> oh my goodness. <laughs> okay, you know what? That's not looking too bad. His mouth isn't quite right, but it's the closest I can get. I don't think there's really like a human mouth on here, apart from that one. Or this one. I kind of like this one better. What else do we need? A nose? <laughs> <laughs> this is so much fun. So he also needs, uh, what else does he need? What, what do humans have? Hair. He needs hair. Perfect. Absolutely perfect. Right, let's, uh, make these as big as possible. There we go. Beautiful. Uh, the only thing he needs now are ears, I guess. Those kind of work. Yeah, those definitely work. Look at our guy! He's beautiful. I think that's the closest human that I can make. Right, let's color this guy. Hmm, are there any kind of like skin colors? I'm gonna, maybe this? Oh. Oh, look at that. That's so cool. Oh, you know what would be even better? This one. This is from the cute creatures pack. Oh, that's, that's awesome. Look, we can make him stitchy, but also like with a color on top. Oh, I don't know what I did there, but um, it looks like he's got a, a shirt on. That's cool. I like that. Right, let's name him. So I'm going to name him um, Who Man. Exactly like that. And let's see him out in the wild. Look at him. Why are you walking backwards? That's not how it works. Did I make you backwards? No. Oh, no, wait, I think he's fine. I think he's absolutely fine. Right, let's walk him over here. His neck doesn't really work very well. As soon as you send him off somewhere, he kind of goes... <laughs> but apart from that, I think we've made an absolutely beautiful creature. Look what we have created. I love him. Can we make him do any emotions? <laughs> <laughs> oh, that's great. That's so good. Angry. Oh, okay. That's pretty terrifying, actually. Laugh. Hey. Yeah, he's so human. Right, let's save this guy. Let's do one more. Wait a second. Wait a second. Outfit has appeared. We can give him hats and stuff. Okay, right. This has changed the game. I'm going to give him this just at the front, because I think that looks beautiful on you. Why are your shoulders such a weird shape? No, that doesn't look good. Um, maybe just the top hat would look nice. Not like that, though. <laughs> 
Yes. There we go. That's more like it. Now he's all human fights. Oh, man. He's even better now. Even better. I am so happy with this guy. Right. Um, let's save. And let's start a new one. What should we go for next? Space outfit to create a space creature. Um, uh, yeah, let's do that. Let's create a space guy. I'm gonna try and make someone super tiny. Actually, you guys won't be able to see it properly. So let's just make one that is literally a ball. What kind of eyes should we go for? There's so many cool eyes in this. I don't remember them being this awesome. I want him to be super derpy. Yes. Oh my goodness. <laughs> <laughs> what kind of feet should we choose for this guy? I reckon he'll have like really fat kind of feet like uh, Maybe this literally a foot. Yep, that's right. That's exactly what we need <laughs> I think he will look good with tiny arms, but I don't know which ones to choose Actually, I don't think he suits arms at all. He doesn't need them. We're just gonna go straight in for the uh, for the weapons Does he need weapons? Does he, does he need to look like a moose? Maybe Maybe. That's cool. That's super cool. I kind of feel like he needs maybe like spikes going down his spine. Just so that no one takes him for granted. You know what I mean? <laughs> or just this. <laughs> Tiny little free hairs in front of his forehead. Oh, this guy is great. I kind of don't know what else to add to him. He's so beautiful. Okay, maybe I did. He's got his own little pigtail. Oh, man. You know what? I think he's done. He's actually done. We just need to paint him. And we're going to go for... Four. Let's choose uh like a caramel color. Hey, okay, that looks quite good. He's got a big brown patch on his butt though. Maybe red. That looks pretty cool. I like that. I like that a lot actually. Purple is nice too. Yeah, that's good. I like him. I'm gonna call him. Let's do the random. Ellie Finor Murds. Detoda <laughs> Otten. That's a good name. I like that. Okay, let's see him walk around a little bit. Let's see what he looks like. Oh no, his legs are not working properly, are they? <laughs> he kind of shuffles to the side. <laughs> right, let's dress him up because he is an alien, so that must mean he can wear more stuff. He can. Look at all this stuff he's got access to. He can get like medallions and stuff. He can put rings around his eyes. Those look pretty good. Bolts in his neck as well. He looks like Frankenstein. Oh no way. No way he can get himself some hair. <laughs> he kind of looks like a really bad judge. Or a bow. He could just go for a bow. You know, like Eeyore? Eeyore has a bow at the bottom of his tail. That's perfect. I don't think he needs to really wear anything else. He can get, like, gears and stuff, which is quite cool. Stuff to wear on his shoulders, but he doesn't have any. Nope, I think he's done. What do you think, guys? He's got his little bow that's the same color as his tail. Bolts. He's got rings on his eyes. He looks pretty happy with himself. Let's see what his expressions look like. Let's do a, um, happy. <laughs> Oh, he's great. What else can we do? A uh, roar? <laughs> that was epic. Do it again. Do it again. <laughs> Punch. Oh, okay. So he just hits you. And he can dance. That's what I'm talking about. Uh, so guys, I think I'm going to leave this here. I've just realized those trees have eyes on. So guys, I think I'm going to leave this one here. We created three awesome people. Wait, what's this? Oh, we can make him do more things. You do the robot dance. <laughs> What are you doing? <laughs> he can howl and be scary. <laughs> Banshee scream. Okay, okay, stop, stop, stop. And he can evil laugh. <laughs> Guys, look. You can get little, little ones as well. Oh, wow, that's amazing. Yes, they don't have eyes because their eyes are too, their, their mouth is too big for their head. Oh, that's a bit upsetting. <laughs> so guys, I think I'm going to leave that there for today. This is super cool. I love this game. I also love the fact that this is uploaded three years to the day that we started the series before. That's crazy. So if you enjoyed it as much as I did, please do a big fat thumbs up. That'd be greatly appreciated. And also leave a thumbs up if you want to see some more creature creation. I'll see if you can unlock any more parts and stuff. I don't really know. But I'll check it out anyway and create some more stuff. But yeah, apart from that, please leave a big fat thumbs up if you enjoyed it. And if this happens to be the first video you've seen by me, please do consider subscribing to join Team TDM today for daily crazy videos. And if you feel like sticking around and watching some more, then please do click this link right here. It'll take you straight to another video handpicked by me. Or you can come to me live in the USA straight here by clicking this link. It'll take you straight over to the ticket website. It will be awesome. I'll see you there. If not, have an amazing day. You are awesome. And I'll see you next time. Bye.